Whose Shoe? Written by Eve Bunting, illustrated by Sergio Ruzera. There's something in that tall bamboo. Oh my goodness, it's a shoe. Finders keepers? That's not true. I'll find the owner of this shoe. Tiger, I have found a shoe. Who has lost it? Was it you? It wasn't I, as you can see. That shoe would be too small for me. My feet are dainty, but I know. My claws need space if they're to grow. But someone's lost it, don't you see? For him, that's a catastrophe. He might still have the other shoe and be unhappy, wouldn't you? I'll try to find him. I'll pursue it. It will be good if I can do it. Spider, I found a shoe. I know it's way too big for you. Still, I want to be polite. I'm asking everyone in sight. I see your mother taught you well. You've got good manners, I can tell. My shoes are tiny, you are right. I always tie the laces tight. If I lost one, I'd be upset. Spider shoes are hard to get. I have eight. I take great care of all my shoes since they are rare. Mina bird, is this your shoe? I think it might belong to you. That shoe would be too big for me. As I fly high from tree to tree, it might fall off on someone's head. I leave my shoes at home instead. It's very nice of you to try, but shoes are useless if you fly. Hippo, have you lost this shoe? I found it in the tall bamboo. There's one thing I find hard to take when I'm standing in my lake. I hate that mud between my toes. I'm rather fussy, I suppose. So I wear shoes. I have four pair and I don't really need a spare. I want to thank you for inquiring. Your honesty is quite inspiring. Hello, I found a lonesome shoe. Someone lost it. Was it you? I'd never wear a shoe like that. I like high heels and that one's flat. These high heels make my ankles trim. They make my legs look really slim. So thank you, but I must decline. My high heel shoes suit me just fine. Good morning to you, kangaroo. I found this handsome, lonesome shoe. Oh, goodness me, that's my shoe. I threw it into the bamboo. I have to say I am astounded that you actually found it. It hurt my foot. That made me cross. I gave the shoe a hearty toss. Would you like to have this shoe? It's not worn out. It's still brand new. Thank you kindly, kangaroo. That's so considerate of you. I know exactly what to do with this handsome, lonesome shoe. Who says that shoes are just for feet? I'm glad my search is now complete. The stars are shining overhead. I'm happy in my king-size bed. Thanks for joining us. If you like this video, please subscribe for more kids story time.